as you guys know, I've always had light hair or like bleached hair. I love changing my hair color and I really like it because it makes me stand out in a crowd. It's become over the years sort of like a trademark of me. So when people talk about Xia Xue, they're like, oh yeah, the pink hair midget. It's been proven because in the Guide to Life episode where I had that black bobbyish wig, nobody recognized me. So I have nothing without my hair. So if you guys remember a few episodes back, I actually met a real life mermaid and her name's Sirena and she is like the perfect mermaid, right? She's super like sweet, she's pretty, she can literally swim in the water and everything, but she just does not have mermaid hair. Like, I'm sorry, Sirena, but no. Today, that is all gonna change because I'm actually gonna transform Sirena's hair for her and giving her a mermaid hair makeover. Yes, it's me, I'm gonna do it. I think she should run far away. <laughs> Have you ever tried getting mermaid hair before? I did. So I tried two years ago. I bleached and dyed my hair like blue, purple and green. But then it really damaged my hair. It kind of fried my hair, plus all the chlorine I go through daily. So yeah. I'm kind of scared to dye my hair now. But things have changed since two years ago. Like there's new technology now. So today I'm going to be using something called Smart Bond on your hair. So I think like today you can actually achieve like your dream mermaid hair. Really? Yeah. I'm very excited also. Because look at her hair, it's like so silky and nice. But normal. Yeah, here's the chart. Oh, all the colours. Do you have in mind something that you want? Oh, I'm not really sure because I have two tails. I have a pink one and a green one and both have gold. So what do you think would match both? I think like this kind of purple is nice. Like ashy purple maybe? Yeah, that's gorgeous. Yeah. Let's do it. Dylan! The guy in the black clothes, huh? always the hairstylist <laughs> that you can trust, right? He will be actually doing your hair today, but I will be assisting him. Okay, so the first step is to bleach the hair. And because like we have dark hair, it's impossible for like light colours to show up on our dark hair when we dye it. So what we have here is the bleach that we're going to be using. And what bleaching does is that it strips away the colour in your hair, but at the same time, it will sort of like break the bonds in your hair. So that will cause your hair to become really damaged. So what Smart Bond does is that it stabilises the bonds in your hair and it protects and strengthens the hair so that it can actually withstand multiple rounds of bleaching without too much damage. Now I'm going to show you how to do the bleaching. Just apply evenly, smoothly. All like that? We're doing great. Okay, so far I don't think it's ultra difficult. It's just that it's like a bit time consuming. So I have a bit more like love for my own hairstylist now to do my hair which is quite long also. Yeah, so when it comes to hair bleaching, there's a maximum effect that you can achieve from like one round of bleaching. So if it's not light enough, maybe you have to do like multiple times. So this is only round one. So with every round, it will actually get lighter and lighter. Okay, so we're just done with the second round of bleaching and like seeing her do her hair, so I want to like kind of do mine. So do you want to do a colour refresh for yourself? What do you suggest? What we are going to do is to add in a little bit of pink mm. uh, pastel in between your current pastel blue and green. It make it more colourful and vibrant. Okay, and yeah. Okay, while we wait for this. Oh, I'm just going to mix some smart bond into okay. the colour mix so that you protect your hair while colouring. Alright, so here I am done with my hair and as you can see, there are like uh, pastel streaks of pink in it. I really, really like it. It's not a huge change but it's very beautiful. Now it looks like pedal pop. Yeah, so Sirena here has sat through three rounds of bleaching. <laughs> but as you can see, so now the colour is light enough to be coloured to a purple colour. And the amazing thing is that the hair is still really, really healthy and shiny and smooth. Like, seriously, I can't stop like touching it. <laughs> <laughs> so coming from someone who has bleached her hair a lot, I've seen my hair at its worst and oh my gosh, it's so depressing. I remember like crying and stuff because all the hair would like like be melty and like mian mian like that, like wet noodles. So the moment you just even touch it or put any form of pressure on it to detangle it, it just breaks. So it's amazing that her hair has maintained the same length. It didn't break at all. It's still really, really good condition. Like it's just unprecedented. I've never seen this before. Yeah, and it actually feels a bit stronger than before. Like my hair feels a bit harder and less thin. So it's yeah. a mermaid miracle. <laughs> it's like a, yeah, it's like legit a scientific <laughs> discovery. We should document this and put it in the Guinness Book of Records. <laughs> okay, so now let's get started on the colours. So Dylan has picked out the colours here. So I think the same thing, we are supposed to pour Smart Bond inside, right? So when it comes to the colouring part, I'm not very confident because I think you really need a lot of experience to do this. So I don't want to screw it up for her, so I'm going to let Dylan handle it. Let me handle it. So which colours are the hardest to achieve? I would say it's an ash colour. Because ash colour, you require to bleach the hair like a couple of times, depending on how light the ash you want to achieve. You have to have the right formulas in order for the ash colour to last. 
natural, it can only be done in salon and it requires professional advice whether your hair can take it or not. Alright, so we have washed off the hair colour and the next step is actually to put the Smart Bond um, pre-shampoo. So what the Smart Bond pre-shampoo does is that it cleanses the hair out of any harmful chemicals so that none of the residues will be left over to damage the hair bonds. And it's basically kind of like a conditioner. So you just put it on your hair for about 10 minutes. Mm, smells really nice, like very clean and like kind of like floral to me. So it has been 10 minutes, now we're gonna wash it off. Wow! It really feels like silky and like smooth. Normally after bleaching, right, the hair will become clumpy and tangled and it's like impossible to remove the tangle and if you try to comb it, the hair will simply just break. Oh, but this still feels like really healthy hair. It doesn't feel like bleach hair. Oh, very tempting to spray her in the face. <laughs> Gonna refrain from doing that. <laughs> okay, so we're almost there. Like um, now her hair is still wet. Um, but I'm gonna touch the texture to see how it's like. Wow, it's like really cannot really tell that it's like bleach hair is like really soft and smooth and not tangly and like if you take like one like strand of hair you can like test the elasticity so if your hair is really weak when you pull on it like that it would just like break but you can see that it's like still strong wow awesome so now let's get her hair blow dried and then we can see the final results so we're done what do you think i know the color is still a little bit dark now because you always go into the chlorine so the chlorine will lighten the hair color and every time you go in it will just become lighter and lighter so the pastel Ooh. color will come out more well, i like that they kind of went for a more sophisticated feel yeah like kind of like a dark oil spill in, in yeah, a good in a good yeah, way yeah, kind yeah, of yeah. colors it's very maintainable yeah. so are you surprised like because your hair really looks very very smooth now yeah i can't believe we did like like three rounds of bleaching. Oh my gosh, so annoying. <laughs> Still very shiny. I think it's really great that you know like traditionally when you bleach your hair it gets really damaged so now that there's new technology you can like just bleach your hair all the time and then change colour anytime that you want and it's still like not damaged yeah and that's really cool and on top of that um, Smartball only adds like 10 minutes to the entire process so it's like no trouble at all so remember guys Smartball is only available at salons so you have to kind of trust the professionals to do it however with this new technology I hope you guys dare to try all kinds of hair transformations so Serena, this is for you. It's um, the Smart Bond Conditioner and you can use it um, at least once a week or you can use it every day. So it will keep your hair smooth and silky. Awesome, thank Yay. you. So that's it, but before we go, I have a giveaway for you guys. I have three sets of L'Oreal Professional Hair Care Hampers worth $500 each. All you have to do is to tell me what colour you will go for if you could do a Smart Bond transformation and why. And remember to use a registered Click Network account and I will choose my favourite three. Good luck, bye!